Hello everyone! We're back with more Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword! On the last episode, we beat the Ancient Cistern, beating Coloctos in the process. One of the most amazing boss battles of my life. Anyway, and on this episode, we're going to do stuffs! Yeah, a lot of stuffs. Anyway, <laughs> no, just kidding. We're doing, um, starting some sort of classes and stuff like that. Yeah, com but in pro progress, some side quests that I start, you know, the large side quests. Anyway, we're going to talk with Mr. Guy of the Scrapper. <laughs> I don't know his name. I don't know, I don't know most of the names around uh, Skyloft yet. That's how newbish I am on this game. Anyway. So, that's a big rated. Let's go for it. Okay. So, 100 bucks. And uh, let's see, he's smashing and smushing and squashing and. <laughs> yes, squashing. Oh, darn, here we go. I got the divine shield. Hell yeah. I didn't think I was the one. Nope, I don't have the materials or I don't have the money. Oh, thanks. Come again soon, you hear? <laughs> Till next time. Anyway, uh, let's get some uh, stamina potion. And uh, let's praise okay for it. There we go. Got a swap of it. And I got the stamina potion. Thank you, sweetie. If you want a potion powered up, go see my husband at the end of the counter. He can make something up for you. So let's go. The blue potion actually is the air potion that uh, makes you uh, have more breath under the water, just in case you don't know. And in case I didn't explain at all, anyway. Uh, so running up here, you're going to. We're going to sleep right now. Uh, yeah, I, I went out and get some items uh, that we need. I will have to grab a lot of Tambla weeds uh, for later in the game for upgrade a little bit more uh, my stuffs like my. I can see from here. Uh, but your divine show, dude. You look cooler with that. Toe is pink, but who cares? It's a freaking divine show. <laughs> like, like, he's a goddess. <laughs> yeah, the next, uh, the next upgrade is goddess. It's, it's the goddess show. Vegeta, what does Connor say about his power level? It's over 9,000! No. <laughs> 55, 56, 57. Oh, whew. I'm sweating up a storm. Good evening, Lunar. I've been training hard ever since we last spoke, but I still feel so sluggish. Maybe I've just run out of energy. Ah, oh, Lunar. Is that, is that a stamina potion you're carrying? Would you mind if I had it? Had some? Take some. <sighs> really? Oh, thanks. I gladly take it then. <laughs> I feel muscular. <sighs> Woohoo! That's the stuff. It's like I'm refreshing splash of energy. <sighs> Sometimes I worry though. Out this training and no results. How long do I need to train before I start to get stronger? What do you think, Lunar? How many push-ups do I think I need to do to get stronger? It's not about the numbers, dude. Huh? Oh, it's not about the numbers. Of course! 
You mean I should just keep at it until I'm forgetting how many I've done, right? <laughs> I guess that makes sense. Now I know that I definitely started getting stronger. Come back soon, so you can see how I'm doing. All right. Because of that, I sleep on your bed. No complaints. You sleep on the couch today. Or I can just go to my room. That also works. <laughs> anyway, uh, stopping being silly right now. Let's go to the night. Uh, to the night academy. Let's get out of here. I, I want to check something. Uh, I want to see if. Uh, oh, the guy is really bad. Look at that. It's over. It's all over. What the? Uh, what do you want, Luna? Have you come to laugh at my miserable state? Just leave me alone. All right, if I say so. <laughs> yeah, awesome. Anyway, let's see if the pivot actually is with Colleen. Uh, oh, he's there over here. Hey, Luna, you're looking pretty up bad, <laughs> bad lately. That's the spirit. Zelda will be home before you even know it. Just keep on believing that a while you're waiting for her to come back. Dude, I'm doing more than just that. You know that. Oh, let's talk with Colleen. Hi. Colleen? Well, well, if it isn't Lunar, you know? You seem to be getting more handsome by the day. That's a nice uniform. It really suits you. <laughs> to give off that a reliable guy a vibe too. Oh, thanks, uh, Callin. Uh, Callin. I, be I believe her name is Callin. <laughs> Does it not? Anyway, uh. Karain! Karain, not Callin. What? Callin is the guy that is depressive. <laughs> Me and the mix up names. That's what I like to do. Anyway, uh. Not that you're just put. A uh, little stuff on our ledge side quest, flag side quest, or whatever is the name of the creepy. Uh, we're going for the Isle of Lovely. I just ran out of stamina right out when I would jump. Lovely, isn't it? Watch your step there. Haven't they told you to on the cut? <laughs> Get out of here with your Zora tonic, dude. Yep. <laughs> I don't know, I just think that is funny. What can I do? Anyway, let's fly to the light shot. Duh. Avoiding the tornado. They really stink. They are annoying as hell, and they throw you to the sky. We are ready at the sky, what are you talking to? La la la. I don't want to get Keep up my toes, tornadoes. Because they suck so much, and they, they throw me at the sun. See, that work. You're a son of a. Die. Get away. There we go. You are on our peace. To the Isle of the Sun. To learn the new song that the gods want to us to know. God damn it! <laughs> no, just, oh man, I'm, I, I'm feeling silly today. I guess... I don't know, I, I'm not supposed to be that happy because my... Grand grandmother is a bit, uh, a bit weird. If you can say, if you can say that, uh, I mean, her, her cocks, you know, her buds a bit beat up. But yeah, I guess she get out of it. I mean, she had nine five years old. She live a lot, but you want us? To, we want she to live even more, <laughs> because it does what you want for your. Okay, just shut up, dude. You're, you're not explaining yourself. That's just for say that. Just to say that I tried to record sometimes, but I couldn't because of that. And you can see by the two 
over there, the skip button. Anyway. Master Lunar, I have imparted the information. When you struck the crest with a skyward strike from your sword, a message from the gods awakened deep in within my memory. The gods intended this message for you, Master. These are her words. He who seeks the secret flames, listen well, for I am the one guiding you from my place at the edge of time. Two secret flames remain, should you desire to possess them. Yeah, yeah, that's right. You must obtain the other gi secret gifts. For each trial you overcome, you shall be blessed with another, with another gift. With him. Harness the power of these gifts, and let there be no doubt that you shall find yourself standing before the majesty of the secret flames. Now, I give you another melody. It will serve you, it will serve as a key to unlock your next trial. It waits you within the shifting sands of Lanairo Desert. Dun, 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 dun. I like this song, actually. The song you just heard is called the Nairo's Wisdom, uses the song of knowledge to find the next trial. You learned the Nairo's Wisdom! The TV just blank! Damn! There. I have memo- I have memo eyes. Damn. <laughs> I have memorized Nairo's wisdom for you. You can now use your dowsing to locate the gate to the next trial. You should set a course for Lana Euro Desert immediately. So yeah, something interesting about Link. Uh, I guess I, sh I suppose to say that early, but... I mean, look at Ling, how many times he got an instrument that he never played on his life and then he just learned after just touching the instrument. Like, dude! I, I guess most of the Zelda games that have an instrument uh, that Link touch, he just do that, he just learn automatically. Anyway, uh, you can see that the dowsing points to there, that is where the... That's where uh, Lana Euro Desert is. It will point to the stream of light that leads to the to Lana Euro Desert. Anyway, I mean, like it happens at a lot of games. It happens on Zelda One. It happens on Link's Link's Awakening. Have an instrument? I don't remember now. Uh. It happens at um, A Link to the Past, it happens at Ocarina of Time, Majora's Mask, uh, Wind Waker, uh, yeah, you can count uh, the Wind Waker as an instrument. The and wait, uh, Spirit Tracks, uh, one more. This game, obviously. <laughs> I mean, I I just trying to get in a point because Link got a, a lot of instrument on his life, and he just played that with like, I'm a master, anyway. And it's not like that bothers me, but that's really awkward. I mean, if I get a violin in front of me, I never play a violin in my life, and just do like Link, I'll be amazed because. That's not like, that's not what happened in real life. 
And if it happens, a really rare case of uh, I have the ability for that. Then again, my grandpa actually played violin, so if I have any notion by my genetic or whatever thing, uh, that wouldn't be so what. But I, I don't know. I, I don't know the the family of Link or whatever. We have arrived at Lana Euro Desert. You can use your dowsing ability to locate the entrance of the trial. You must pass to open the way of the secret flame. To the secret flame, sorry. Anyway, that's right over there. I don't need to look. I know. Anyway, uh, what I'm going to do is go for it. Go for tabloids. I'm needing them a lot. Alright. And probably that's what I'm going to do for the rest of the episode, guys. Because I have five minutes and I can't do the trial on that time. There we go. There's two already. Uh, I guess I go into them. Ten. I have how many I have? I di I didn't see how many. I have three, so just leveling seven. I'll see how many of them I can get. Yeah, on the take yesterday I get a. Lo oh, whoa, whoa! Come here. There. And my head is itching, I guess you can see by the camera. Anyway, so how's your guys how you guys are going? <laughs> Damn, I just I just mess up Oh Two at the price of one, grandma. There is fifteen now. Oh fifteen I said <laughs> Damn, six. Anyway, so how how are you guys going? Um I think we're having a nice not a nice weather because it's raining two days straight. It started yesterday at 3 p.m. and it goes until this morning basically. Right. Let's get back to the cactus. Usually up here one there or two. Oh, I said, I said, said, <laughs> I said it. Anyway, uh, let's go here. Oh, I listen. I I hear. Oh, there, there. Ah, oh, crap. Ah. Yeah, there's a place that they spawn. I I guess I'm getting most of them because, uh, I have the the treasure medal. So. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa! Come back here. Come back here. Anyway. Then the ready eleven. <laughs> Uh, let's see how many can I get these butterfly. I'm gonna get these butterfly. Come back here. Come back here. Actually, I get 12 yesterday, yeah, and I and they reach the the limit time. That is the 20 minutes that I imposed to myself. Anyway. Oh yeah, just say that I get a lot and they just vanish. Oh crap! Anyway, um, I guess I having a nice. Oh shit! <laughs> I go visit my my grand grandma today. She's fine. She's uh, just you know a bit awake because she's she's really old. Oh, she's ninety five. Anyway. Um, what I want to say more? Yeah, I guess that is a called the episode, guys, because I'm reaching nine, 19 minutes. Oh! It's not supposed to throw the bomb at the tabloid, dude. That's not fair with the tabloid. It says for dang sure. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, crap. Let's see if I get closer here. Oh, there, there. No! There we go. Well, we got on my limit, guys. So I'll be stopping here and see you guys on the next episode. So I thank you guys for watching. Oh, you're you're son of a cactus. And see so you guys then. So thank you guys for watching. And bye bye. Oh, thanks for the nuts I'm needing now. Bye bye.